Hi everybody, my name is Amanda. Welcome to Lollipop. Um, this is my first video for this site. Um, I'm going to do my makeup today with minimal products. Um, that's what today's video is going to be, as well as introducing myself to you guys and all that good stuff. Um, so first things first, um, I'm a mom of three, I'm a wife, I'm a tattoo artist, and now I'm starting this vlog. I've decided that 2019 is going to be a new year for me, to where I'm going to be more confident, I'm going to try to do new things. So here I am. <laughs> Um, okay, so first things first, we're going to start with the makeup. And we got CoverGirl True Blend. It's uh, 1, 2, or I2. I can't tell what that, if that is. But um, we're going to start with that tonight. Um, like I said, it's going to be with minimal, minimal items. So we're just going to make do with what we've got, y'all. Use the lighting. Okay, let's put some dabs on the face first. So excited to be with y'all. I, um, <laughs> Actually, I'm surprised I'm not nervous, but it's probably because of the 20 million takes that I've done to get to this video <laughs> right here. And I mean, for real, I've, every single day for like the past few days, I've been trying to get this done. And every time, I just look like a moron to myself, so I end up deleting it and starting over. Excuse the pimpails. I got pimpails. I have very pale skin, so this color kind of works good for me, I think. I just need to try to avoid my tattoo right there. I got a little bow. It's blue and turquoise. Oh, excuse my facial expressions. Anytime I con try to concentrate, I make some pretty weird facial expressions. I draw... And I drive. <laughs> Alright, I think I got all the services. Oops, got my neck. Okay, I need to give y'all a heads up. I'm not very good with makeup. I've always been more tomboyish growing up. I mean, I'm pretty much just using my face as a canvas right now and, you, you know, going with it. So, let's, uh, I know we've got to blend, so we're going to blend that down into my neck a little bit. All up in there. <laughs> Do y'all have any suggestions on how I should be doing my makeup, honestly? Go ahead and put a comment below. And while you're at it, don't forget to subscribe or like my video. Or, hey, both. Okay, so let's do some concealer. This is Physician's Formula Super CC. Uh, what kind of color? Light medium. Can you see? Can you see? Alright, so we're just going to put some of this on here. Get rid of... Yeah, let's turn this way. Yeah, there we go. That's better lighting and y'all can actually see what I'm doing. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that beforehand? Let me put my mirror here. Alright, so... Let me... Yeah. 
layer on some concealer. I know um, most people do the eyes first, but I'm so accident prone that I just do them last so that I can deal with any mistakes there and then. You know what I mean? And I'm pretty good with not getting um, eyeshadow everywhere, so I don't really use that much. I never have. But another thing I've got to change. I've got to experiment with my makeup. And that's one thing we're going to learn with each other is how to teach me how to do makeup. And how to express myself more with my makeup and be comfortable in my skin in my makeup. So I've always been really nervous on what people thought of me. I know. Insecurities. Everybody's got them. And I'm working on mine. I know. I'm working on mine. Okay, I gotta put some around my mouth, y'all. I don't know why, but I, this, the tint around my mouth is always like a white so it looks like I have like a white ring around my mouth at all times. I don't know why it's always been that way. So hopefully we can fix that here. Yeah, I got a dark blood vein there that you can see through. It's like a blow, like a blue. How's that? I'm gonna get my trouble spots, and then we're going to try to bake my face. I don't have any baking products, so we're just going to wing it. <laughs> I know most of you makeup enthusiasts out there are probably saying, what? No, don't wing it. You know what you're supposed to be doing. Get the right products. Honey, I'm broke. We're gonna work with what I got. All right. All right. I will be getting some products soon though, hopefully. Shine Cosmetics, I will be putting a subscription down in, I mean a subscription, but a link down in the description. <laughs> okay, let's get that, that. Okay. Go get those crow's feet, not crow's feet, but what do you call that? Kunai's? Yeah, you know, because raccoons have black eyes. Okay. I have really bushy eyebrows. Really bushy eyebrows. I try to tweeze them, but then when you try to tweeze them, you end up losing some of the shape that you had originally. So I just... I just do some like plumbing around the, or however you talk about it. I just do a little bit of uh, landscaping. There we go. Landscape. Browscaping. That's what we're going to call it. Browscaping. <laughs> okay. So, like I said, I don't have any baking stuff. So, what I do have is this mineral wear. Um, it is creamy natural. We're just going to use this. Okay. We're just going to use that. To see how that works for us. <sighs> I didn't realize how bad of a glare there is in my camera, but we're working with it. The cra the screen's kind of cracked, so we're just kind of deal. Okay, so let's go back into our good position here, where there's natural good lighting, and we're just gonna pile on this powder to try and bake and set my face. Yeah, I'll keep finding myself making faces. <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh man, I want to see what I look like whenever I'm tattooing. So we're going to take a video of me whenever I'm tattooing as well. Because I know I've got to be concentrating like crazy and making some crazy faces. I know the last time I seen a picture of myself whenever I was drawing, I was just like... Back to work, Amanda. No one wants to hear you ramble. And plus, I gotta get back to my housework. I got laundry to do, y'all. I got another film to do for y'all to be able to post tomorrow. Whew. Gotta stay on top of stuff, man. 
Let's see here. Okay, let's let that sit for a second. I'm gonna set. I think that was a second. Okay. <laughs> I'm just like really impatient. Okay, so here we go. We're going to um, try to contour and um, blush and highlight and all that stuff. Sorry, I had a hair on me. But you see, I'm not very good at contouring and all that. Last time I contoured, I looked like I had a really, really bad instant tan. Like someone just like all over my face. It's a trophy. <laughs> it's like I'm using it as a trophy. I'm getting there, y'all. I'm getting it. I'm, I'm getting it. <laughs> oh, man. I crack myself up, but I am an idiot. All right. Uh, if I haven't said so already, I just wanted to say hi again. Hope your day is amazing. Let's get some of this. Maybe we can, ooh, we can disguise the double chin. <laughs> yeah. Screw that thing. Screw that thing. Do I try it out? All right, come on. Blend, man, blend. Come on. Can you tell? It's blended. I think it's blended. I don't know. Oh, I don't know if it's blended good or not. There's too much shadow in here. So we're just gonna work with it. Yeah, I think we're doing good. It's, it's, yes. Let's do the other side. Ooh, let's try to disguise my scar. Whenever I was a little kid, I fell out of the station wagon straight on a sharp rock. So that's where that scar right there is from. I'm trying to disguise it as best I can with my widow's beak and little hairs. That's why it's kind of going in a sideways motion there. <laughs> Alrighty then. I don't know why I need to put contouring stuff there, because I mean, if you notice, I got some pretty hardcore cheekbones, so anytime I'm like, you know what I mean, you could already see my cheekbones are like, but we're going to do this like we're supposed to, or at least how I think we're supposed to. <laughs> Oh man, I'm gonna have to take a class on makeup and on glamming. Isn't that what it's called nowadays? Glamming, not just makeuping. Y'all, I gotta learn how to glam myself. Cause let's be honest, I'm not glammy. I'm not glammy. I'm not really girly. I'm more boyish, tomboyish. So I'm, I'm a getting there, y'all. See my daughter's face whenever we're done with this. She's hilarious. Do something different with your face. She's like, huh? <laughs> okay, so I think that's enough stuff. Or I'm gonna end up having like a weird little beard going on here. Just trying to blend that out a little bit. <sighs> All right, let's go to. L mini brush. If I remember correctly, I gotta do my nose, my bottom of my lip, maybe, I think it was. Oh well, if I'm wrong, y'all, I'm just gonna look even more retarded than I already do, so who cares, right? I don't. Alright, let's see here. Hmm. I don't want to do it too dark because, I mean, I already have a pointy nose. I do have a really pointy nose, and so contouring ends up making it look like I'm Pinocchio. So I'll just do halfway down to emphasize it to make it look a little bit more wide. Hmm. 
I'm gonna smudge it out. I'm smudge it out. You know, I don't know what you got. I guess blending it, but I'm just using my finger, so I'm kind of smudging it. And we're gonna get the bottom of my lip. Emphasize that thing, right? I mean, I already got a pouty lip, but I guess that's just to make it ten times more pouty. Well, make it look more pouty. Or like I've been sitting there sucking on a dirt pile. <laughs> All right, we gotta do that one. Oh, I forgot to put stuff on my brush. I'm just sitting here doing it. Okay, that and that. Is that right, y'all? I don't know if that's right. But see what I mean? It just made my nose look ten times pointier. What do I do? I don't want a pointy nose. I don't want to look like Pinocchio. So I normally don't do nothing with my nose, I just let it, you know, be, sit there, just be there, just be on my face. Telling my eyebrows, just be there, be there, you big old caterpillars. Alright, so, let's get back to this. Sorry, the more I move around, my shirt rolls up. It's not small, it's just, I'm fat. <laughs> I don't like my roll, if you know what I mean. Alright, so next thing's next. <laughs> next thing's next. I guess I'll do some blush. I mean, I don't need blush. But, might as well just do a small, small, small amount. Because last time I did this when I was a kid, I looked like freaking, I don't know, what what kind of clown is there out there? I don't know any names of them at this moment. Well, that's not too bad if I do it lightly. I think when I was a kid, I just went to town. I didn't, I didn't really have any very good experiences putting my own makeup on. Unless it was my eyes. I always did good with my eyes. If it was the rest of my face, it was just plain white. You know what I mean? White. Alright, let's color in those rosy little cheeksies. Okay, now let's move on to highlighter. I don't really... Oh, I forgot to... Oh, I forgot to show you guys what I'm using for my contouring and stuff. It's BYS Contour for Family Dollar. <laughs> it works, y'all. Minimally, it works. So. Ooh, irritates. Okay. Ba, ba, ba. I'm going to use my foundation brush. I should have used this in the first place. If that's my foundation brush, then what's this brush for? Hmm. Is that a foundation brush too? Yes, it is. It says something coverage foundation. I don't know, but we're just going to work with it because, I mean, like I said, I have minimal products and they're, as you can see, many different brands. Sorry, my little wiggle hairs just keep on popping out. Okay, so. <gasps> Did I do con... Yes, I did do concealer. Okay, so now we need to do highlight. I don't know about this stuff. Isn't highlighter supposed to be like white and highlighty? Hmm. Got my cupid bow. Got my cupid's bow. Get my chin. I don't think I need to emphasize my chin, y'all. It's kind of big as it is. Okay, do the other side of my eyeball. I don't know why I'm singing. I don't know. I don't know, but we're working here, so maybe that's why I'm just trying to concentrate. And that's what's coming out. Alright, so we need to get the forehead, y'all. In the top of the nose. Ooh. I put it in the contour on accident. 
Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll emphasize that spot there and get rid of that anger bridge from being frustrated. Oh, it's going to soften it. Oh, yeah. I need to like massage my eyebrows or something. I didn't realize how hardcore my. I got like blended good enough, y'all. I think so. Yeah. All right. What's next? Oh, what's next? Oh, what's next? Eyeshadow. A shadow, a shadow, a shadow. Let's do. All I have is actually, y'all. All the only thing I have in eyeshadow is these two palettes right here. Got them at Walmart at one time whenever I was just running through there. They were cheap. I think they were like five dollars a piece or something. But that's what I've got. And as you can see, my kids got a hold of this one. So I think we'll use this one with some pinks and stuff. Even though I'm wearing blue today, flip it. Oh well. No, I don't know. We're just going to go with something here. We're going to just start putting, putting on some colors. Putting on some colors. All right, we use this. What does this brush for? I shall brush. Okay, so we're going to use this color here in the crease. Y'all, I just said a minute ago that I wouldn't make an eye mess with my eyeshadow, but I just did. I just did. Of course I did. I'm so accident prone, it's retarded. I'm sorry. It's messed up, is what it is. I'm so accident prone, it's messed up. You know how many times I fell in my life, or fallen downstairs? I mean, for real. You should see my shins. I don't know about that color, y'all. I think I need to put some pinks on it or something. I think I started off too dark. I like that. But it's not too bright either. I think I'm using too dark of colors, maybe, because my eyes are looking kind of weird over here. Oh, crap. I had freaking makeup on my finger and I just smudged it. Oh, well. I'll use some freaking concealer. I'll use some concealer. <sighs> so, okay. We're going to start with the lighter color this time. On this side. Yeah. A lighter color works better. There we go. <laughs> I keep clicking my eyebrow ring on accident. Yeah, I should have done that in the first place. Let's try to just, yeah. Layer it here. That's not too bad, right? I don't know, you can't really tell the color with this camera, can you? But it's like a pinkish color. Can you see it now? Here, let's just grab this. There, now you can see the coloring. See it now? I think that's okay, right? We're just going to change the aspect of this film here to where y'all can see what I'm actually doing. Like I said, I'm just pretty much 
painting my face. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just painting it. That's not too bad. And trying to use uh, my memory on what kind of looks would be best, you know? I don't know why it keeps glaring like that. Y'all just gonna have to be patient with it. Okay, let's do a little bit of dark on this side so it'll start matching. I just wanted to be all shiny today for some reason. See, I got my gold plated blue shirt. Not plated, but you know what I mean. That looks cool. I like that. Let's try to put some more pinks into it though. Let's try to blend it in there. Comment below. What do you guys think? Is that a nice look for my eyes so far? I don't know. I haven't done it like this before. I hope my husband likes it because, I mean, let's be honest. His opinion is the only one that freaking matters. He's the only one that actually has to look at my face every single day. Besides myself. And so, I at least want it to look really freaking good for him. Here, so can get back to falling. Here, it's all gonna work. You kind of sideways a little bit, but y'all are gonna be cool because y'all can still see me. All right, let's try and do some. Con I, I've seen people do concealer on your eye on your eyelids so that they can get their eye like um, eyeshadow to stick a little bit better. So I guess we'll try that. Okay, make it brighten up. Oh crap, I just realized that my eyes are too different. Jesus. Help me here. Help me, Lord. Okay, so what did I use? What did I use on the freaking eyelid? I don't remember. Screw it, we're just gonna keep it the same pink. And then we're gonna hide over overdo it with something else. Okay. Ooh, I wish y'all could see that. I'm gonna show you in a second. I'm gonna move the camera so you can see so how like, shiny my eyes are. After I get that top layer done. Yeah. I'm happy with it now, y'all. It's starting to come it's starting to come together. I have a problem. I start panicking before you know, before I'm even finished. So <laughs> Oh, I forgot. I think I'm supposed to do my underlid, right? That's why it's looking kind of crazy. There we go. that but we need to put some dark to it too I think give it some oomph yeah there's that oomph so I ain't got the eyeliner done yet and I don't think I'm gonna put any eyeliner on the bottom part I haven't decided yet So let's go back to what I was trying to do. I'm here to go with the concealer. Alright, so. Okay. I'm sorry, my hand's blocking my face for me, guys. Like I said, I'm getting used to this stuff. I gotta start filming more so I can get really good at doing this with y'all. Okay. 
<laughs> All right, let's see. Yeah, okay, now let's hurry up for it dries. A pinkish kind of gold, kind of. But that's not what I wanted. I wanted something a little bit lighter. She just came in with the silver. Here we go. No. Let's try layering this pink. That's just gonna have to do. Y'all, I just put like four layers on my eye, and I don't know if it's gonna work out for me or not. Yeah, because this eye's a lot lighter than this eye. Okay, some more pinky on there. I don't know why I said pinky. I hate it when people don't pronounce their words like they're supposed to. It's so stupid. I mean, what are you a toddler? You gotta put a Y on the end of your word. It's just so stupid. Alright. That's just gonna have to work. Okay, okay. Okay, so the only kind of pencil that I have for my eyebrows as well is this, um, oh shoot, um, eyeliner brow pencil. I know, don't cleanse at me. Don't cleanse at me. It's the only thing I've got, y'all. So we're just going to work it in to a couple of parts because, I mean, y'all, my eyes are already pretty freaking thick and bushy. We don't want to look like. I have extreme caterpillars, you know what I mean? So we're just going to work it into the corner spots where it's all faded out because my eyes are like reversed ombre. My eyebrows are like reversed ombre, like for real. Like you know how most people want it to go like light color to dark color? Well mine goes light color to dark color. Good. That's good. You don't want to go too far. Okay. So now I need to do my eyeliner. Where's my thing, my bob? There it is. I'm using. Turn it around here. I'm using Voluminous Superstar Liquid Eyeliner from L'Oreal Paris. L'Oreal Paris, and I love this one. This is the first one I've ever bought, but I've I've loved it from the first time I've used it. Cause look at that tip, y'all. Look at that tip. I love this one. I think I'm going to stick with it, but who knows, because there's a bunch of different brands out there, and I'll probably fall in love with something different. Okay. This is the only thing that come, my drawing stuff comes in handy for whenever... I try to do this, but I mean, there's a good amount of time where it doesn't come out good at all. Like I, I have a problem with getting one side either too thin, one side either too small, or one up more, or one down more. It's never, never equal. Can't get equal. Feels like some body parts, man. Can't get them the right size. Alright. Back to being an adult. Okay. I'm gonna get this done. Got this and some mascara left, I believe. <gasps> I forgot. I gotta do my lips, too. What? Look. Is complete without a lip. 
And that's going to be something else we're going to experiment with. Because I'm not really a lipstick person at all. And so we're going to we're gonna venture out there. And every single video we do, we're going to try a different color. And I think today we're going to do a bright red. Okay. I just screwed myself up there. Y'all didn't see it because my arm was in the way. But... This eyebrow eyeliner kind of screwed me out of there. Oh, oh, no, 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 don't do it, don't do it. Oh my god, y'all. I fudged it up. I fudged it up. Oh, man. My right eye looks sexy as hell, but my left eye looks fudge to fudge. <sighs> I've got to get better at this, y'all. I've got to start practicing more of my makeup. <gasps> oh, I think I fixed that a little bit. I just widened it out a little on another spot. And y'all, I don't know how to do eyelashes. I don't have any eyelashes. The last time I got some eyelashes, all I could afford was some cheap ones from the Family Dollar. And I didn't know how to do them or the glue. So they ended up just like one corner piece would stick on over here and like the other corner piece would stick on. But it would just flop there. You know what I mean? It would just flop. <laughs> That's just going to have to work, so I'm not going to sit here and nitpick it for hours. Let's show you guys what I've got so far. Right? I think I did a little bit good, right? Let's get the mascara. And then we'll be finished with the eyes. We got number one, and then we got number two. This is a primer and mascara. Two in one. Um, I... All the writing's gone, so I don't really remember what it is. I think it's a L'Oreal. I do believe it's a L'Oreal. If y'all know what brand this is, just put it in the comments below. Okay? If you know what brand it is. I don't remember. So, the how it works, though, is the primer goes on first. So, we gotta put the primer on. Oh, I need to close this eyeshadow. Put that over there. Okay. Put some primer on first. I like that. It's all fluffy and big. Voluminous. Very voluminous. Very, very voluminous. Okay. Primer on eyeball number two. I just realized my eyes are green today. Hmm. That is cool. My eyes are green. Normally they're bright blue. I do, I think that's called hazel, right? Not hazel, but um, what's it called when your eyes colors change? Like, my eyes are like a mood ring. Hope y'all like my backdrop. Couldn't think of anything else to put up there, so I just put some of my drawings. Figured, hey, I like them. Maybe y'all will too. So, yeah, there's something to look at while you're looking at me. Ooh, I may have messed my hair up a little bit. Look, it's supposed to be one of those poofy things along with a pony, you know? It's supposed to be like that, but... I put a little bit too much argan oil in my hair last time I took a shower the other night. Well, the other night. Night before last. And so, it's 
kind of greasy now, so please excuse my greasy hair. But yes, it is a lot. Okay, so back to what I was doing. We gotta get back to the mascara. Mascara, mascara. Instead of the white bird poop, we gotta go into the black bird poop. Isn't that right? Like back in the day, mascara used to be made out of bat guano. I can't remember. And we just kept tacking that stuff on our faces too. Just kept tacking it on. I bet you it's still made out of that stuff. And we're still sitting here just tacking it on as much as we can. Get those eyelashes up there as possible we can. Very, very good. I think after this, I'm going to do like a little Instagram moment. You know what I mean? Take a picture. So if y'all want to hit me up on Instagram, you can find me at a Cisco. 68. That's A S I S C O 68 on Instagram. Um, always love to have more followers, and I will follow you back in a heartbeat. Let's see here. I just remembered I forgot to lay meat out to defrost. Oh. Fix that in a minute. <coughs> Ooh, shouldn't have held like that. That tickled. Alright, so now let's do some bottom eyelashes. Don't normally do the bottom ones on a daily basis. Like, normally it's just like. I'll throw some mascara and some eyeliner on if I feel like being pretty, but not lately. I'm gonna do it this time though. I'm always so scared that I'm gonna poke myself in the eye or something. Like that. Down the floor. She carried away, move her hand in the wrong direction. And pow! Right now, I'm off. Okay. <gasps> Oops. No! It did it again! It did it again! God, my left eyeball is like all screwed up today. I have done a single bit right on my left eyeball. My gosh. Okay, let's leave the left eyeball alone. We got the mascara on. We're done with the eyeball. Okay, so we got three colors to choose from. I think there's pink, red, and brown. Let's see. They're the only colors I have at this moment. So I think we're going to do I can't decide. Let's do any any mini mini mo catch a tiger by his toe if he hollers make him pay fifty dollars every day. My mom told me not to pick you. Okay, so no pink. Any mini mini mo catch a tiger by his toe. Okay, we're going to do this one. No, we're going to do with brown because I got bright pink eyes. I think I don't want a whole face full of color today. I just want to keep one thing a pop and one thing of hey, I'm luscious. So we're gonna work with this shit. Let's find my lipstick thing. My kids got onto my makeup, my lipstick as well as my eyeshadow, and so look what they did to my make my my lipstick. Look at that. Look at that. And that's all the way up. I mean, that's all the way up. So that's why I have to use my brush. <laughs> oh, man. Alright.
Oh, I got I got a scar on my lip because I got too close to a dog's face when I was a kid, and so I have to watch it because it goes straight into a line up my lip. <laughs> All right, so here we are again. The left side is not wanting to cooperate. I think this is worse than trying to paint a freaking 8 by 10 photo with extremely small details. You know what I mean? That's how I would judge this. Painting with extreme details versus painting your lips. I do love this color though. I forgot how much I love this color. It's a very great matte color. It's all bland and not so shiny. I love the matte. Ran out a little bit on that one. So here is the finished lips. Well, almost finished. I gotta do a little button here. There's the con. There we go. There we go. Alright, so now I'm fi I am finally done. Finally done. Okay, finally done. Here is the final. Final view of my pretty little face. I enjoyed hanging out with y'all today. Let me put my glasses back on so I could see what I'm talking to. Here we go. All right. It was nice hanging out with y'all today. Very, very awesome to freaking meet all of you. I hope you all join my community on Lollipop Channel. And, well, time to go get some dishes done and some dinner started. So, see y'all next time. Don't forget to subscribe and... Make sure you like this video if you want. Oh, don't forget to hit the notifi notification bell. I almost forgot that one too. Make sure you hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a video. I'm Amanda, and it's great to see you.